Hello, today I'm going to show you how to draw a Celtic knot. Let's make a new document. Go to File, New, and set the profile to Web. Click OK. Let's change the fill color to None and leave the stroke black. Select the Polygon tool. Click somewhere in the center and type 120 for the radius and 3 for the sides. Click OK. Now we will draw a circle which center point intersect with one of the triangle points. Select the ellipse tool, click on the artboard and type 300 for the width and 300 for the height. Click OK. Using the selection tool, line the center of the circle with the triangle point. Let's make two more copies and line them with the two other triangle points. Click in the center of the circle and holding the ALT key on your keyboard, line it with the second triangle point, then let it go. Let's make one more copy and move it to the third point. Now we will draw two lines to mark the center of the triangle. Go to the pen tool. Click in the center of the circle, then move your mouse down and holding the shift key on your keyboard, click on the line. Press A to deselect and let's draw another line. Press P for the pen tool, click in the center of this circle, move to this line and click in the middle where you see the word intersect. Now we have the center point, which we will need later. Go to the Layers panel, click on the little triangle to see all sub-layers, and let's lock two of these layers and turn off their visibility. Let's do the same with the triangle layer. Select All, go to Object, Path, and select Offset Path. Type 25 for the offset and click OK. Now we'll draw a smaller circle in the middle. Go to the Layers panel and turn on the visibility of these two layers with lines. Select the Ellipse tool, click on the artboard and type 190 for the width and 190 for the height. Click OK. Using the selection tool, move the center of the circle to line up with the intersection of those two lines. Let's hide these lines, turn off the visibility of these two layers. Click on the small circle, go to Object, select Path and Offset Path. Leave the offset as it is and click OK. Select All, go to Pathfinder and choose Divide. Now we are going to delete the parts that we don't need. Select the Shape Builder tool and holding the ALT key on your keyboard, drag the mouse across the shapes that you want to delete. Let's flip this image horizontally. Press O for the Reflect tool and select the horizontal axis. Click OK. Select everything and press the up arrow key several times to move it up. Now we are going to merge some shapes to form the under and over segments of the knot. Select the Shape Builder tool and 
drag to connect the shapes. Click and drag. Click and drag. It can be difficult to keep track of which is which, so it might help to have a sketch for reference. Select all, open the stroke panel and change the stroke weight to 2. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.